Manifestation can be fun and easy, and it should be, and that's why manifestation works so well for certain people, is because if you remember back to the very first book or the very first reference to manifestation that came to you was probably the book The Secret, or it was something kind of like that from Neville Goddard, or something was led, or Dr. Joe Dispenza, something about manifestation that intrigued you, the magical part of it intrigued you and you became more childlike reading it and said you want to know what I want to try this I want to have fun with this I, this this sounds magical I want to see if this will work in my life this is awesome you know I'm just gonna play around with it like that idea of just playing around with it and then you had success using it because you had that mindset of just wanting to play around with it and enjoy the process of it just to just try to improve your life and play around and be more childlike. But now you've lost that as, uh, along the way. Now you're taking it so serious and you've got all this stuff going on where you're waiting for this to happen. You're waiting for certain dates. You have certain numbers attached to it and it has to be at this certain time and you're waiting for it. You're waiting for your manifestation to come. Creation is finished. You already have everything that you desire right now. And that's why you were able to manifest immediately or very successfully when you first began, when you were playing around with it. It's because you didn't need it. You weren't in that sense of need. You wanted to play around with it. You didn't need to play around with it. You thought it was magical. You thought it was fun. You wanted to see if it, this magical part of the world or magical part of manifestation is actually real. And you discovered that it was. But now you've lost that somewhere along the way. Now you've lost that somewhere along the way. Now you're taking things so serious. You're not in a state of gratitude. You're in the state of need. You're, not in, you're in the state of lack and you're waiting for it. Stop yourself when you start feeling this way and start saying to yourself inwardly, creation is finished. I live in a simulation. I have everything that I could ever desire right now in the present moment and I am grateful and I am thankful. And when you stop yourself like this and you're very present, you will find that feeling again of, of being childlike and knowing that creation is finished. You already have everything that you desire right now. And there'll be, a, there'll be a knock on the door. There'll be a phone call that comes to you where all of a sudden you have the $10,000 or $100,000 or whatever it is that you're trying to manifest that you haven't been trying to manifest or you've been trying to manifest that hasn't been working out for the last few months you will find that as soon as you just let go of something that's holding you back, this idea that creation is finished and you have to wait for something or go somewhere to get it is the reason why it's, it's waiting at your door right now. Like it's literally at your front door. That money is right there waiting to come in and just waiting for you to unlock that door. It wants to walk through and just hand it over to you right now. Unlock the door. Let that manifestation in and know that you already have that right now. Get back into the childlike state that you were in when you first started manifesting or you first read the secret or you first read that first book where it was just so magical. You're like, wow, I can change anything in my life simply by imagining it or simply by being changing my mindset to being positive and loving and you know and seeing everything in that mindset you know where it's everything's working out for me perfectly and creating feeling states the secret of feeling that mindset now you've attached all these other things to it that are preventing it from from coming into the, the door to your door walking through your door but it's there i promise you and if you say these things right now if you start using this right now Start doing it today, right? As soon, right now, during this video, start doing it. Become more childlike right now. Know that creation is finished. Creation is absolutely finished right now. You have everything that you could ever desire right now. You need for nothing. Creation is finished. There is an infinite amount of realities that coexist simultaneously with yours right now. Where there's a version of yourself that has everything you want right now in this present moment. Right now in the present moment, there's a version of you that has everything that you desire. And you and it, that version of you is no different from you, except feeling that they already have everything that they desire and they know that creation is finished. 
and they've attracted those things to come to them. And as soon as you can feel the natural state of yourself being that person, you're going to have it. It's going to be yours. You're going to shift into that world, quantum jump into that world where that's happening for you, where it's happening for you right now. Creation is finished. Start loving every second of your life. Be grateful for everything. Because whether you realize it or not, this is all true. This is all real. And you have everything that you could ever desire right now. And your failure to see that is the reason you can't, you can't you're not aware of it. You're aware, it's outside of your awareness is because you haven't fully grasped that concept or that fact that the way the simulation operates. Your simulation is designed by you, by, the, by your higher self, by God himself. You are God asleep right now. You are a particle of God and you are sleeping. And understanding this ability, just manifesting this, this, this new concept of yourself, of understanding that creation is finished. You have everything that you desire right now. Those doors will open. They're waiting. They're waiting for you right now. Start acting as if. Start being more childlike. I brought this up in this video because we, I was doing a school event this morning in my private community. And we did like a live event, a Q&A for over an hour and a half, almost two hours. I wanted to make sure everyone's questions are being answered within the community. And that was, that was, this is a primary thing that I'm seeing, you know, from most people is that, that, that manifests a lot. They have, they have had so much success manifesting at certain times when they first began, when they didn't overthink things, when they were just playing around. That's the, that's the word that I hear so much, just playing around with manifestation. That's what they were doing. Just playing around with it. And they manifested every single time in that state. So what does that tell you? Stop taking things so serious. Enjoy the present moment. Creation is finished. Feel yourself into this new being and start loving life. Smile. Just smile and appreciate what you, you know, the, the greatest thing, even if, even if your reality right now isn't showing you everything you want to see, it's just a simulation projecting what you truly believe that you have within you. Start disregarding what you're actually seeing until it comes and even after it comes. You're still seeing the same things. You can see all those things now in your imagination. Start playing those scenes out in your mind. Know that creation is finished. You're living in a simulation, a, a virtual holographic world. Start loving it. And it has to reflect that change from within you. Once you start feeling that and seeing that, regardless of what's happening in your world, it's a self mastery. Stop taking things so serious. Stop taking things so serious. Know that you have everything that you desire right now. You need for nothing. You need for nothing and that door is gonna open for you. I love you all, I wanted to share this. And if you want more answered questions, join my private community in school. I'm making sure that everyone's answered, everyone's questions are answered from now on within the community. And I'm gonna do as many live events as I need to. We're doing three live events now for multiple hours. So I love you all and I will see you in the community.